Hey guys, I am Rajat and in this video, I am going to talk about how you can install Arrow OS 11 that is based on Android 11 in your Samsung Xeno 7870 devices. So the first thing that you need to do is turn off your device and boot it to the custom recovery mode by pressing the volume up key, home button and the power key at the same time. Now after opening your custom recovery mode you have to wipe your device for that just go to the third section called wipe and then select Delphi card cache cache system and data and after selecting these four options swipe the arrow to the right side for wiping your device. As you can see that my device has been successfully wiped so let me just show you the zip files and the image file that you need for installing this ROM. For the installation, I am going to use the CreateVendor zip file, uh, the image file of the AeroOS JSI and thirdly, I am going to use the Age Vendor modded version. But if you don't have the Age Vendor modded version, you can use the Age Vendor version 1 and then you have to install the patch version of it. And the last zip file that you need is the BitGFs, sorry, NickGFs for Android 11. Now to install the JSI, first of all, flash the CreateVendor zip file. Now once you have done with the installation of the create vendor zip file just reboot your recovery mode. Now just flash the image file of the AeroOS GSI S system image. As you can see that the image file has been successfully installed, now just go back and flash the age vendor modded version and if you don't have age vendor modded version then you can use age vendor version 1 and then you have to install the patch version of it. If you are wondering about the last zip file that is left is the nick jabs you need to install this zip after the first boot otherwise it will not work. So here is our AeroOS JSI that is based on Android 11 and in terms of performance everything is just working uh, but the major issue is that the Play Store is not still added. To add Play Store again turn off your device and boot it to the custom recovery mode and flash the Nix apps and that's it. Here you can see that the play store has been added but it is not going to work because this is an uncertified google device. I have already made a video uh, how you can fix this problem. You can check this video from the iCard easily. So that's it all about this video. Kindly subscribe to this channel and guys I will talk to you in the next one. Bye.